Hello people. So let's talk about the gravitational waves and the G constant which was recreated in the Cavendish experiment with two lead balls and they according to this experiment came out with the constant. So let's see what are the magnetic properties of lead? So lead, like most other ma materials, is diamagnetic. That is, it responds to external magnetic field by generating an induced magnetic field opposite to it. So, that experiment could also be detecting a magnetic wave field also. And they show us the magnet, uh, the gravinet, gravitational waves, as these animations they show us, like these ones. They say that these are gravitational waves, you know. So, could they be also seeing this? Because this is very similar to gravitational waves and these are magnetic fields. So are they really detecting gravitational waves or magnetic fields and they are being fooled by the maths they are being presented to calculate this basically. So ask questions and keep on asking questions because the gravitational waves doesn't seem to be real and basically I think they are magnetic fields only. Thank you for watching.